get a pulverize off. That's might be a, just a bit too much to ask. He onslaughts in, does like a Tokyo drift around the black hole, dun, dun, and then dun, grabs dun, Enigma dun, from dun, behind. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Somehow, alone, he's kind of gapping the Monkey King, even if it's by a little bit. I think he double oh, him really early on. In comes Michael, level 2 gank. Just enough mana for a spike and perfect execution. Invaders. I'm gonna Luna. steal that one. Getting fried up here, Kotaro. That's kind of one of the downsides of the Chen. There's nothing much you can do as a hero unless you have a creep. Yeah. Three members of... Okay, this has gotten very awkward now. <laughs> Michael's the one to overcommit. And suddenly, out of nowhere, a full party. Five members uh, just butting heads here in the most awkward way possible. And it seems like Alone still wants to go fishing with his Tidebringer. With one X marks, but he doesn't really have a lot of mana. Doesn't even have a stick on him. Starting to get slowed down now. Robo Z, it's three levels in the Jingu. Suddenly he has the damage. And Alone, he might have just overcommitted unless Face Boots just walks it off. What? Oh my god. What is happening? <laughs> what was that? Like a double what was that? He has dominated so far. Yeah, I mean, what he survives the there, but doesn't look like Stinger will be quite as lucky. Like you mentioned, the lethality of this duo has to be studied by scholars. I mean, through with the Dawnbreaker ultimate, but a preemptive cancel alone. He's being run down right now. The control that he's had over this early game eroded slightly. It hasn't resulted in his death just yet, but Kiri threatened to be chased down. Has so a nice flame fast. break, but... Yeah, I mean, just with the wind lace as well as the boots, the torrent won't catch him. And this is a classic Kiwi plays right here, just wasting yeah. the goddamn time of his opponents. Um, as we look off screen though, I believe it was Adrian who got worked down by a returning Luna. As oh my goodness, are you? Oh, 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 oh. This is so much space from Kiri though. This is so good. Right, you or to rotate with rather, you kind of have to get a kill when you use all of your abilities. Especially when you're not level six, it's so hard to stay on top of heroes. Like we saw with Kiri there, right? Kiri just runs away without even using any movement speed abilities. Well, oh my god, easy. Shido. Yeah. He instantly pings out the wall though. But yeah, I think this is what we were mentioning. You want to invade these earlier areas. Kotaro being run down right now, but Kiri, he doesn't have the HP to operate with. The rest of the defending members of Plasma come through though. They want to chase down Kotaro. The move speed, is it enough? Prada was there to clean up, should it not? And now, uh oh, the supports. They look to be in trouble. A cute little net from one of the creeps from Stinger, but this Chen hasn't really had the early game dominance they would have asked for. Gonna come through with a double stomp, mid no, just catching Robo Z, but easy for them to chase through the tree lines, and looks like this top tier one tower is forfeit from the side of invaders. And look at where the rest of invaders are postured. They had they no position to help this Luna out. This looks to be a bit of a return kill, and a much bigger one at that. Robo Z will come through with the out, but it's actually only two heroes. They turn around, Dobre Gal comes through, they'll finally lasso her down and work through the Luna. Black hole on the sideline, straight onto Michael. Sacred will come through and at least claim up a support as a return. The rest of the side of invaders want to stand their ground and fight, but I'm just wondering if they have the ga gas in the tank. Sacred, he's able to get a double kill with that extended damage thanks to the uproar, but now, okay, Stinger is bringing in the creeps, but they will just eat the hammer alongside him. Alone has finally showed up into the fray. They should be able to punish Adrian. He's pretty tanky, actually. Tidal wave. If he can get another hammer swing off, they might be in trouble. Up to the high ground, can't face off against Alone's blade mail, though. Sacred narrowly surviving in that situation. As Alone, he's not done yet. Another TP uh, interrupt. No, Tidal wave can't stop no. it. Feeling pressure to make the most really deep. This economy hasn't really been their priority, but that might prove to bite them mid lane. Robo Z shows his face. It's a very nice mischief dodge on the ghost ship. Gonna turn around with that Wukong Taman as well, trying to beat down on the Stinger with that Diffusal, but he doesn't have enough damage at this stage for it to be meaningful. Meanwhile, Prada gets killed off by the Saker and Michael duo. Invaders, they're just striking on multiple areas on the map. Adrian fished in to the whole lineup as well. And you're at the point, Plasma, where I can't help but feel like you're starting to bleed. It is. No, it uh, is. Other than <laughs> right. the most Here oppressive goddamn post for Euro in the, in the game. Oh, this is coming right now. Man oh, of you service. Need a, you, they are not a mana service, more like a murder service. In comes Sacred and Shido. He doesn't have any help. Prada, you have that. I mean, black hole, but you might just have to turn around and sacrifice your life. I don't think it's going to be enough to get you. I might give him a bit of a false sense of security. In comes Robo Z. Looking for Onsa out of here. No, not in time. The boundless. And now he's starting to run away. Pop the blade mail open. 
Adrian coming through with the hammer, all are healed, and turn around the Eclipse, the Luna is starting to do a significant amount of damage to Glaives, just rip the Monkey King apart, alone now, has his eyes set on Adrian, the Solar Guardian coming through on the Shido, oh, no. but they just can't kill the Luna, Finger of Death down, and now control up is Shido Kiri, no more ultimate, he can't do a thing, Prada, he might just throw in the black hole into nothing, you'll just suck yourself straight oh, into the yikes. ground out of embarrassment, uh, this is what he always he just feeds, but it doesn't matter because his team is doing other shit on the map. Look at Sacred now, setting up on the Adrian, and you don't have a hammer to get yourself out of here. Carol, he's just doing so much damage. Sven's gonna come through, but you have a God String and the BKB, but not a way to close the gap. And yeah, Kiwi understands the rest of the side of Invaders coming through. Uh oh, Shido showing himself. Oh, they'll pull Prada to the high ground. Easy wave. setup. That Enigma is dead. This Enigma into Lion matchup is quite difficult too. If you... so yeah, okay, shut the fuck <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay, well, uh, I don't know. I just say it because it sounds cool. Okay. But now, they're going to make the go onto alone. With their hand of God, still not enough. That's really the only thing Plasma can play for, bursting you down 100 to 0 before invaders can respond, and they might have just found their opening now. Michael, and a teensy weensy bit of a bother as well, but can turn around on this very convenient high, uh, just highway, and a uh, spike. Oh, sacred, no fear, just charging in with the power rider, interrupting with the stun. They buy back on the loan, actually, they want to fight. Just whipping Robo's the apart! Kutaro, the solo black hole, but Shido needs to get the touches immediately, but you're not doing enough damage. Luna's just gonna rip you to shreds. Denying Raw is the best way to say it, as Plasma just get completely splattered like blood on the ground. Go, 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 go it up to the high ground. Yeah, I mean, oh, might as well be a BOGO go. Pulverized. Where's your black hole hiding in the bank? Not even off cooldown just yet. Kiwi dies in his own lair, so this oh, is perfect. It. I don't really yeah. see how you come back into the game. You'll buy back. GG is called brother. He knows the game has lost, is lost when he sees it. And 25 minutes is all it takes for invaders to completely dismantle Plasma here. It wasn't even close. No, it wasn't. Invaders, they nailed every single timing perfectly, right? It was run around, make space for Luna. We only have to do it for a little bit. She's one of those beautiful carries where, you know, on like an AM, you only need to make space for like 20 minutes. She comes online. She has complete free farm. It's time to run at you. And they did it even before the 20 minute mark because of how online Luna was, how far ahead Kotaro was. There was no stopping point for this Luna.